Okay. Is everybody staying weather aware today? Um, some big storms the news is calling for. You know, I always, uh, you know, I, I listen to them and things like that, but do I always believe them? Not 100%. I've taken off days and rescheduled photos and done all sorts of things before, and nothing ever happens. So I just stick to my schedule. New listing right now in Northwest Oklahoma City, Pepper City North High School. Uh, last one that we had in that area sold, I think, in 11 days, which is super awesome. God really blessed us with that. Uh, this one, you know, hoped to have the same results. The sellers are pricing it at market like they should, and they'll probably get multiple offers. I've got to swing by the customer's office, I believe, and get the key, because I want to go make a spare key. I really hope. I gotta figure out the spare key part right now. Because it says they didn't have one. So I've gotta figure that out. So, so I'm gonna pull over, make a couple phone calls on my way there, and then uh, just go from there. So, all right, everybody be safe today. Be weather aware. I did some awesome work on my backyard bench yesterday. I really wish I had videotaped some of it, but. I just wanted to get it done as fast as possible. I got it all done in five and a half hours and I was beat. I was super beat dead. So, um, anyways, I'll see you guys at this house. If anything cool comes up between now and then, I'll definitely let you know. And uh, yeah, you guys are really good. This is a really cool house. It's huge. It's a uh, four bed. Three and a half bath, three car garage, built 1995 with 2,833 square feet. It is huge. Really awesome house. Can't wait to show you guys this one. All right, Josh, Better Homes and Garden Real Estate, Paramount. I will see you on the next clip. somewhere let me know which brand you use um, there's five different zips located throughout Oklahoma City and seven seven or eight I don't know there's a bunch I'm able to usually always hit one on any appointment that I'm going to which is super helpful God, I wish that giant truck would get out of my way because another car is going super fast Okay, perfect. The giant truck's going to the doctor, so I hope they're okay. Oh, man, guys. We are... Yeah, so I'll do a Facebook Live if you're a member of Josh Better Homes and Garden Real Estate Facebook group. You'll have a sneak peek to everything because whenever I do Facebook Lives there, those are live. Uh, YouTube doesn't allow me to do live videos, so I never can do a YouTube live video. So, members of the Facebook, people who like the Facebook business page, get Facebook live updates before everyone gets it on YouTube. Uh, Alright, I've got to plug in this ad. 
address, so I'm going to pull over and start doing that, and then I will see you guys on the, um, on the next video. Talk to you soon. Bye. Okay. I'm going to go get the sign. All right, guys, Josh Bartett, Better Hopes of Garden Real Estate. I'm going to put a sign in the ground real quick, right there, right there. And then I'll tell you about this house that we're having a photo shoot on right now. All right, give it a big thumbs up, share it with all your friends. Don't go anywhere. I'm going to put the sign in the ground and then I'll be back. Okay. Got the sign, let's put it in the ground. Okay, got the sign in the ground. Let me show you one of the things that I do with these signs. I don't put them, the T-posts, all the way in the ground. See right there? See what I do? It, it, when people weed eat around the signs, I leave these up a little bit so that people don't weed eat my sign. So I thought that was pretty cool. All right, let's go get a rag, wipe down the sign, and then I'll tell you a little bit about this house. Well. Let me go ahead and tell you about the house behind me right now. So it's coming on the market. Contact your agent if you want to schedule showing. I should have the photos back tonight or tomorrow and it'll be live ASAP. But um, it's a four bed, three and a half bath. In Putnam City North Schools. And it has a three car garage. Built 1995, has over 2,800 square feet. 2,800 square feet, folks. So if you're looking for a big house, it's gonna be priced to sell. I don't wanna tell you sales price till I bring it live. I still think that's fair. But as soon as we bring it live, I'll tell you the sell, you'll see the sales price. And uh, yeah, you'll be happy with it. So, um, you know, you guys are familiar with these signs. Gotta keep them clean. And I'll actually be reaching out to my sign company and I'll have these professionally refinished. So, all right guys, Josh, Better Homes and Garden, looking for a four bed house with three and a half baths in Putnam City North with a three car garage, great access to everything, even the brand new 7-Eleven and walking distance to Putnam City North Schools. Give me a call, 405-315-7965, 405-315-7965. Josh with Better Homes and Garden Real Estate Paramount Oklahoma's listing agent. All right, guys, have a great day. Thumbs up. Thanks for all the views. Thanks for all the love. I'll see you on the next video. All right, just finished that photo shoot. Let me turn the air down here. No tornado sirens yet. I hope you are all being weather aware. Uh, asked the missus if she wanted some ninja sushi. So that's where I will be going right after I visit Lowe's. I'm gonna hit the Lowe's on 2nd Street. I'd like to go to the Home Depot on Penn, but because I'm getting Ninja Sushi, I'm gonna hit the Lowe's on 2nd Street, and then hit Ninja Sushi on 2nd Street. The, uh, I guess I could've hit the Lowe's on Northwest Expressway in the Ninja Sushi on Rockwell. But this way it'll be more fresh for me. So that's what I'll do. All right, I'm gonna take you guys to Lowe's with me and you guys are gonna get to go through the difficulty of finding the one nut and lock washer, two, two nuts and lock washers that I need to fix my recliner. My wife and I, we purchased uh, the most expensive recliner that the store had 
I've got to fix this. And this little bolt attaches to the lever arm that raises the feet up and down. So, and there's two of them, one on each side. So I've got to pick up a new one of these. I got to pick up a nut that goes on the top because the piece that it went into was uh, threaded, but it's stripped out. So now it doesn't attach to anything. So I'm going to get two nuts and two lock washers to go on that arm mechanism underneath underneath the chair to fix the recliner. And I've had to put two lag bolts back into the into the recliner also. Uh, yeah, I I thought if I got the more expensive one, I wouldn't be having to do stuff like this. And I've actually never done anything like this on any recliner before. So. Uh, now I can understand cushions getting worn out. I'm a 250 pound guy, so I understand cushions getting worn out. But all the mechanicals and the frame and stuff, come on, seriously? Anyways, do you guys have some good recliners that you've used for a long time that you recommend? Not that we're going to buy new recliners anytime soon, ever, probably. Uh, but do you guys have some good recliners, some good stores? I, I've had a lot of chairs in my life. I'm 38. 38. I've gone through a lot of recliners over the years. And uh, I'm happy with this recliner. I just wish I wasn't having to do maintenance on it. But all right. Well, guys, uh, I will see you at Lowe's and stay weather aware today. Bye. Okay, Lowe's was super busy, so I didn't do any filming. Um, when there's a lot of people around, I don't want to upset someone by filming, so I didn't do any filming when I was in there. Um, this, so this is called the Joby Mobile setup. I use it with my camera phone, with my phone and camera when I'm doing stuff out in the field. That's where those Facebook lives come from. Oh wow, something's going on. Well, your bonus on your current job. Over there. Let right? me. Well, let's not talk about it, right? Because who knows what that could be. Let me but, pause my podcast. But the bottom line is that. Okay, podcast paused. I want to place the to-go order at Ninja Sushi for Aubrey and I and Little Rhett right now. I'm just gonna get the chicken fried chicken. Um, let me look up their menu real quick. They have chicken fried chicken, chicken, chicken fried rice, chicken fried rice. They have chicken fried rice there, so I'm just gonna, I'm gonna order that right now. So let's place that to go order. Whoops. I gotta get Aubrey's list. Can I place a to-go order? Yes, ma'am. Okay, for you. Can I get a Philly roll, a firecracker roll, and then what sizes are the Ninja Balls orders? Uh, ninja, Ninja uh, poppers. Yeah, the yeah the the ball thingies. How how? What are those size orders? Four or six. Can I get a six on one of those? How many? A six. What else? A chicken fried rice. Okay. And that'll be it. What's the name and order? Josh. Josh, sorry, I'm at 10 minutes. All right, thank you. Thank you. Bye. All right, I placed that order before I'm leaving Lowe's. That way, it'll be there. So what I do... Right? I've been doing pause this my podcast. business for 50. Okay, pause my podcast. So now, uh, let's go pick up lunch. And Lowe's didn't have the 8 inch um, Whirly thing that I needed. So I have to order that offline, which I'm disappointed because it's going to be expensive offline. But I've just got to order it. I've been there three years now and I haven't ordered it yet. So I'm going to go and order it. All right, I'll see you guys on the way home. Have a good day. Thank <laughs> you.